two hours. Two hours. You can't see the gestures he's making right now. Two hours. Two hours. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the freaking Sword of Kings is an impossible drop game with Magic Lorelei. Uh, well, I'd say hello, everyone, but I'm actually kind of scared right now. So anyway, yes, finally it has happened. After multiple times where the game dropped presents from this enemy, it turned out to be super bombs from the little freaking exploding robos. Mm -hmm. Even more game ways the freaking game trolls you with those freaking enemies. Yeah, huh? But this is finally ours. Sword of Kings. Mm-hmm. I hope you appreciate this shit, Pooh. I guess he is back as Ness's slave. But so. see, super bombs dropped from the freaking robots. Not quite as rare as the Sword of Kings, but still very annoying to run into repeatedly. Pooh, you better pick up that fucking sword. Yeah. Weapon. Cool. His other two items are in the future, and they are both laying in gift boxes. Mm. There are other weapons for people that are just as rare drops out of enemies. Mm -hmm. Luckily, they don't they don't come in a time limit like this one does, because once we finish this area, the Starmen Super disappear. Oh. So you can't come back later and do it. You have to do it before you take out the boss. I see. So this is literally the one shot to get it. Mm-hmm. That's great. Yeah. Remind but, me to tell you how much of a jerk I think this game designer is at times. That's game designers in general. Yeah. They may seem like they're trying to provide you with entertainment, but the truth is, is that they're all aiming to break your soul. So, anybody remember those level oh, numbers? Oh, Jesus. Oh, he's homesick. Yes, he is. Jesus. So anybody remember the level numbers that were there and I told you to remember them? Yeah, 20, I told you they'd be higher. 20 plus levels. Yeah, roughly. Roughly? Yeah, 18 to 22, I think, was the spread. Mm-hmm. But yeah. So a lot of levels. A lot of levels, yes. <laughs> So there are a few other things we want to pick up from here. A broken harmonica. Yep. Oh, that's something that appeals to me. I'll just take that. Well, you know. She didn't get to keep the sword. And also, unbeknownst to me, there's actually a butterfly point up there that respawns really, 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 really rarely but it respond just enough to keep me from having to go all the way out of here. And then I became so grossly overleveled for this place that, well, you know. Well, I'd rather be grossly overleveled than grossly underleveled. Ah! Oh, that, that hurt. Mm-hmm. Yep. It doesn't hurt any more than usual. It doesn't matter what numbers it shows you. As long as you take it out first, it'll still only get 30 to 50 hit points out of you. Still. And we learned this. Oh. Jeez. 24 Dang. psychic points. But it puts you where you need to be. For everybody at full health. Come on, a little bit further. Nice. Splat. And these are all the supers? The uh, regulars are mixed in here too, but that was a super. Oh. And the other one disappeared. Yep. I can tell the difference because the supers give everybody 7,000 experience. Ah. Uh. The regulars only give about 5,000. Splat. Brum, bum, bum, bum. Ah, oh, and we've gained another level. Yes. Oh, 
Nice. Nice dodging. Well, I was invincible up until that last little bit, too. Mm. Oh, baby! And you keep gaining levels. Yeah. Oh my god. So, you know, just in case you were wondering, this is a good place, I guess, to grind, because you, one, you get the, uh, you get the sword, which is kind of be kind of important. Unless you wanted to be completely unequipped. See, the thing is, it's it's only a 30-point attack boost for Pooh. But it's so the only thing So you can beat can. the game without it. But it's the only thing that he actually can equip. Mm-hmm. Oh, he can equip slingshots and yo-yos, but those reduce his attack stat. Right. Well, that's effectively equip him yeah. with. So anyway, exit mice, just in case you needed one. Mm-hmm. And you will want one. Not for this section, but oh. I do like this section. I like this. That's actually kind of cool. And that's really kind of terrifying. The fact that they can chase you like that can probably actually be terrifying to people too. Just like... If you catch them on the wrong thing, or you take the wrong turn. Yep. Oh, that was this the military octobot? Uh-huh. Nice. Only not. I well, it's not the exploding robo. No. And this one didn't get the actual chance to get a no. shot in on you. Yeah, over le I am now OP. Yeah. I'm not complaining. I would so much rather you be OP. There we go. Unfortunately, you hit him too much from the back. Ah. And then his buddy decided to come and join him, too. Yep. I'm sure that's going to make it easier. So, what does the uh, military Octobot do? Restricts you. Ah. Of course, this is so much more fun because Ness is homesick, too, so... What happens with homesick? He spends random turns doing nothing. Ah. Uh, he thinks of his mom, or he misses the bee pie, or, I you know. Ah, uh, the days before cell phones. Yep. Well, remember, he has a receiver phone. Yeah, but she never calls. Yeah. Bitch. Only dad calls. To annoy us. I could have many comments. Pixie's bracelet? Mm-hmm. Is that for Paula? Yes. And well, it's a technically for anyone, but... I'm guessing. Yeah. But yeah, I could have a lot of comments about the fact that he's got a mother who doesn't call him, who gives him the, like, two-second conversation before hanging up again type thing. But, I'll leave as is. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. I've yawned a lot this Let's Play. I'm sorry for that, guys. Clearly, it is just nothing but boring for me. I'm actually deeply invested in this story. This is actually really cool, but... Can't control the awning! Yeah, it's a ten point over the diamond band. Nice! So. <laughs> Plus, if I'm not mistaken, it actually does a couple of status things. Yeah. Keeps you from being hypnotized and also increases your luck. Mm-hmm. That's good. Now the question is, can I find my way through this place? That is an important question. It's a new capsule. That's yep. good. So like you mentioned before, this is kind of where the actually good items come mm -hmm. into play. Ness needs to get faster because he's starting to lag behind there. Mm. There's another item down there. And I can't recall how important that particular item is. 
but I think I will try to get that, well, I will worry about that later. Mm. So I can come back in here when everything's running away from me. Oh. That's a lot of people that have been kidnapped. Uh-huh. Including a Mr. Saturn? Yep. I can't see anything. Jeff. Mm-hmm. That's Tony. Huh. K.O. can breathe. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Oh, no. Can't breathe. Yeah, they're having trouble breathing in liquid. Yeah. I'm noticing a lot of smart people in their ranks. Uh-huh. Like, actually smart people. Unfortunately, we can't look at Doctor up there. Yeah. Well, if they can't breathe, then move on, good dude. It's not nice to keep them waiting. Hello, Starman. You're much stronger than our intelligence indicated. We are not prepared for that eventuality. The prophecy from the apple of enlightenment may be true. Okay, what are you talking about? But you must not underestimate us. Yeah, well, we're also massively overleveled, so. Yeah. Ooh, that looks nasty. He has shoulder spikes. Yeah. That looks Fortunately. Nasty. Yeah, don't have enough sword, but you know. Well, that was less dramatic. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Maybe we can solidify him. Oh. Ooh. That's not good. What are you doing? Are you killing your party? No. Oh. I just knew that the multi bombed rocket would finish them off. So you were just showing that? Mm-hmm. So you hurt these innocent kids for no fucking reason? They're not that innocent. Well, no, they have killed quite a few creatures, but... Well... When you defeated the Starman DX, the Stonehenge base ceased functioning. Mm-hmm. And all the enemies are gone. Well, that'll make the item gathering much easier. Oh, good. I was scared, but I knew it'd be saved if I courageously just sat here and waited long enough. Well, you were right. Mm-hmm. Bunch of kids saved your ass. Yep. I'm so glad you saved me after all. So there's Sebastian. Oh. Do I have any space? Yes. Kidnapped. Happy. Rescued. I give you ribbon. Jeff got the Saturn ribbon. Hey. Okay. I expected there to be about a 7% chance that you would rescue me. I thought it was just a good... I just thought it was a good opportunity to meet Mr. Saturn. I also got to meet Mr. Andonitz. See ya. Um, what? Well, remember. Hmm? He has a book. Yeah. You looking for the... You looking for the book Overcoming Shyness? Mm-hmm. I return it to the Yonet Library. Okay. So remember when I asked you where you would expect to find a book? Yeah, library. Yeah. Or a bookstore. Please use the book to help the shy tend to try. Anyway, because I knew you, I had an incredible experience. Wow! He is an optimist. So wait, were they... specifically targeting people that these people that our team here had met? Not necessarily. Uh. I was kidnapped. Well, I guess he wouldn't actually be here without having met Ness. This is true. Yeah. So now there are more people who are aware of Gygus. Mm-hmm. Since our imprisonment is now over, I want to start on the phase distorter as soon as possible. Oh, I almost forgot to thank you. Yeah. Don't worry about us. You've got important things to do. Thankfully, I can ignore your ass, at least for now. Mm-hmm. I was kidnapped while milking a cow on the farm. 
Didn't think they'd get a ransom by kidnapping little old me. That's great. Jeff! Jeff, buddy! Oh, me oh my! You, you came to rescue me! Pow! Oh, Ness? I'm Tony. I'm Jeff's best friend. I've known him for the longest time. But now you're gonna be his best friend because you're the protagonist. Something like that. This is the happiest moment of my life. No matter what happens, I will live, live, live 10,000 years. Is this guy a hippie? Yes. Thanks for all that you've done. Great. He is one of the hippies. Yes. Well, I'm glad he'll live for the next 10,000 years or some Live, shit. live, live. For the next 10,000 yes. years or some shit. Are you happy with that? Are you happy with that? Sorry, I'm talking to the cat. I say the cat, but it's actually been more than one cat, by the way. It's not just the one cat that has been interrupting our episodes. Yeah. Broken trumpet. Broken trumpet. So, harmonica, trumpet. Mm-hmm. We're going to be starting a band? I guess we could. I mean, we've got four people here. So, anyway, that is all the items we need from here. Mm -hmm. So, just because I don't want to sit here forever in a day... Ah. Well, that's nice. Thank you, Mr. Exit Mouse. Yes. I think that's... Is that our first recorded instance of actually using the Exit Mouse? I think so. I don't think I used... Well, no, I think I used it earlier. Mm. Well, yeah, I think way. I think I did use it. So now we know where we need to go. We need to go to Onet. Mm-hmm. All the way back to Onet, and hey, we can take care of that homesickness mm -hmm. at the same time. I don't I do know if actually... I have quite enough room here. Yep. Nice. I will say that it is an interesting game mechanic to have your characters have some sort of status effect from a, you know, realistic experience. Mm-hmm. A kid would get homesick. Been a while since we've been here. Bright and super saturated with every color that we can possibly see. Yep. We'll pass by the library for the moment. That is where the book is. Well, I mean, that's where our kid said the book was. Mm -hmm. But it's a good thing that we rescued them. Yeah. Hey, Ma. Ah, yeah, this is a good chance to restore. Yes. Everyone get into bed. The same bed. Ah. He gets over being homesick. So I have a few things to take care of off camera. I have stuff to repair. Mm -hmm. I have item management to take care of. Mm -hmm. Again. And... It's much easier now that we have direct access to the freaking store. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, instead of having to call for it. Mm-hmm. So. Quite a bit earlier than the past couple of episodes have been. But I am going to go ahead and call this a finished video. And when we return, we will be back here. Ooh, butterfly. We will be back here. We just restored. I know. But the butterfly's right there. <laughs> and that's me hitting the plate on my desk. <laughs> the plate apparently disagrees with me grabbing the butterfly. I'm so sorry for you guys. <laughs> and anyway, yeah, when we return, items will be managed, etc., etc., etc. And we will be ready to grab or at least go check the library for the book. Hope to see you guys next time. Take care, everybody, and I am sorry about your ears. <laughs> Later, all. <laughs>